All right, let's see here. I think my mic's at a good enough volume, but if it needs to be turned up, I don't mind doing that. Um, okay, so let's get this started here. Oh, and my game stuff stopped working. Hey, oh, hi, Twix. Where'd my game go? <laughs> Come on, don't do this to me now. Yes, hi. Capture card, what, uh, what happened to you? There you go. Oh, sorry for that close-up of my face there. It's not appealing at all. <laughs> okay. Capture card is good. So. Uh, but now I lost... There we go. I'm losing it, I swear. Oh, I need to turn that up. Uh, Alright, my own... Uh, game audio for myself was a uh, pretty low okay so we are let's see currently I did some uh, dex grinding today um, on a separate stream that I did earlier um, and we are going to continue on with the story a little bit um, at least for an hour um, maybe longer. I, I want to at least get to the next uh, noble Pokemon before we do anything else. Okay. Got a lot of shanks and one Burmy. Okay. So we we did do Wormples. That's done. And I think we were really close with Shinx. Yeah, we just needed to feed a bunch and catch some, so and evolve it, but that's obvious. Um, Eevee as well. We need to catch those too, but like I said, we're gonna do story, so we'll worry about that later. <clears throat> And do let me know if my uh, if my audio is too soft, like my mic audio. Um, I have an issue with my voice being really low, so I'm gonna try and keep an eye on it. Okay. Oh, you're actually talking to me, like actually talking to me, and I was just skipping through it. I'm sorry. Um, what would I like to do? Okay, yes, I want to go to the village. Thanks. Okay, and I did mention it in my daytime stream, but if you did miss it, um, uh, the night before, we lost a heavy amount of Pokemon. <laughs> like, let me, let me just show you what our team... Uh, or what our, our our fainted pasture looks like right now. Yeah. <laughs> um, I made a huge mistake when fighting um, Ursa Luna, and half my team was not healed. And I knew this would be my downfall, because I lost... Uh three or four Pokemon in that battle. Um, Wormful was a throwaway, but I lost Cherubi, and worst of all, I lost the starter. So if you see uh, down at the bottom with the sub goal, I actually am making uh, my er, sub goal, my follower goal, sorry. Um, the follower girl goal is gonna be to bring uh, the starter back, Dartrix, um, with a black magic ritual. <laughs> so, um, let's see. 
Yeah, so we lost a lot of uh, a lot of good Pokemon, and I'm really sad about it. Oh wait, we wanna. I do wanna actually change that because we have a Caskin with us. Mm. We had a Baneri on our team, didn't we? Yeah. I think it was this one. Yeah, it was. Okay. <clears throat> Alrighty. Let's go get this done. And we need to keep an eye out for a water stone. Oh, we can go and bring... Um, what is it? The oh, it's not like hay. It's uh, getting a hold of new wares. That's what it is. Hardy grains. We can bring that to the dude that's inside while we're while we're doing this. Okay, and he's just downstairs. So. Um, I went the wrong way. I went too far. There we go. That's what I get for taking my eyes off the screen for a second. I don't know if I can do this man's voice. Oh, if it isn't the Survey Corps recruit who called Lord of the Woods. Uh, here is Choi's errand girl, are you? Don't waste your breath. I've got nothing to sell to him and his store anyway. Now go on, scurry. Pestering me for goods when I'm already tearing my hair out, trying to get hearty grains. Sheesh. Oh man, I'm very close to you and I don't like it. <laughs> Wait, you got the hearty grains? Would you let me have some? Please, just three stalks. I mean, I don't think I should because you were so mean, but go ahead. Ah, hardy grains. The Crimson Mireland's finest feature. The sway of those golden brown stalks across the landscape that fills me with yearning for home. I'd wager if you combined hardy grains with other ingredients, I'd, I'd, it'd bring out a taste, tasty aroma that would make Pokemon gather around. All right, I won't send you back a failure since you so kindly brought me these hardy grains. Tell Troy I'll set him up with some new wares. Okay, <laughs> will do. All right, let's go head on up to uh, the commander and see what he wants. Twix, quit playing with the mic cord. <laughs> oh, great. Akari. We have a situation here. Let me explain. Lilligant, our clan's Lady of the Ridge, is in... Oops, I accidentally pressed that, I'm sorry. Is in peril, danger, something like that. <laughs> and Arizu knowingly kept this from me. Lady of the what now? Yes, there are only female Lilligant, which makes this honored one... Our Lady of the Ridge. But this isn't the time for cultural lessons. <clears throat> I'd like to find out just what Arizu was thinking, but she's nowhere in Jubilee Village. <clears throat> last I saw, uh, she was heading, or no, last I sh saw, she was at the Wallflower, polishing off a big old plate of potato mochi. 
Not that I blame her. My cooking is simply irresistible, after all. If Arizu of the Diamond Clan was somehow involved in that situation with the raging Ursaluna, the Pearl Clan, that could lead to the two clans going at each other's throats again. Tell me, Commander, if we do end up in a struggle with the Pearl Clan, what will our people do? Or, your people. What will your people do? We would be forced to remain neutral. Meaning what? If we were to show support for one side, it would put us at odds with the other. We came here to create a home for ourselves, not to take part in tearing the land apart. Right, of course. After all the work you've put into getting us to treat one another as equals and keep us from fighting, I suppose it's no surprise you'd refuse to intervene if trouble were to break out again. Akari, perhaps you have some idea how we might address the situation. Mm, I mean, yeah. We could just call a big fluff ball. Go find him. Her. Go find her. Ursa Luna. So he and Warden Caliba found you worthy? That's perfect, then. Ursa Luna should be able to sniff out Arizu. Well, wherever she's gone. If you're strong enough that Ursa Luna deemed you worthy, then you should be ready to quell Will against Frenzy as well. I'll head to Lilligant's seat, then, uh, then, er, I'll head to Lilligant's seat then, Brava Arena, it's called, if you'll excuse me. You are excused. And if you'll excuse me, my English is, uh, uh yeah, as I've mentioned in, like, every stream, it's pretty awful. <laughs> Let's see. Listen well, Akari. You must quell any Pokemon that could cause harm to the people of Hisui. Always remember, we came here to make a new home where we could live without war or strife. Yes, sir, Mr. Ker Mr. Kamado, sir. Okay. So let's go. Uh, yeah, there's no more like things in here I need to do, so. Let's go turn our side quest into Choi, and then we'll just run off and, uh, yeah, do this whole Ursaluna thing. Oh, <laughs> I'm sorry you had to deal with all this. Tao Hua and I have had some complications before, but thanks to you, we've got excellent new items to offer. Do buy some. Hey Twix. Um, please don't step on my computer. I would, I would greatly appreciate it. Thanks. Thanks. You can, yeah, you can just, you just hang out if you want. I'll, I'll make some room. I'll move things over. You don't gotta go. There you go. Okay. You have new things. Let me see. Mmm, nothing I want. Thank you, though. Um, let's see, I kind of want to change our hairdo, but I think I'll wait until, until next time. Let's check our styles real quick. Alright, what kind of fancy things do we have? Oh, not hats, because I can't wear hats with this outfit. Pokemon kimono, fancy kimono. We've got the weird ear, which I actually really like. We have cleaver. Hey, quit. <laughs> and we have Ursa Luna. Um, I think we're gonna go with, I like the seascape one, but right now I kinda wanna change it to the white one. So. Um. There they are. Okay, and I really don't think anything else has ever caught my attention, except for maybe a new hat, but... Okay. <clears throat> um... Oh, 
let's, before we go, I know I keep adding things on, but this is really important because I haven't checked her in a while. Let's go to Zizu um, and see if we can add on some moves to some of our Pokemon. And maybe that way um, we'll be more likely to survive if we encounter something we didn't uh, expect. <laughs> okay. Let's do Kelpsy. Yep, Shadow Ball. I want that. Gimme, give gimme, give gimme. Give um, Shadow Ball and we probably... I'm ha half tempted to do Iron Tail just so we have a steel move. Mm. Let's check out everyone else first. Let's see, game nothing. Uh, Dazzling Gleam might be a good one. Oh, we can get rid of baby doll eyes and still have a fairy type move. Uh, quietly focus his mind, calm its spirit. Mm, we're gonna learn Calm Mind just so we have it. I don't know if I'm gonna add it into the uh, move set or not, but I, that's something I also really like about this game is that you can change the moves on the fly, um, and I think that's that's really unique because. You can just pick them, or you could you could literally buy all of these, and then um, you know uh, pick them when you when you actually you know need to use them. Um, rock types, but. That's weird, it can learn Poison Jab. Never would have expected that. Uh, I mean, Monferno is weak against water. So maybe it would be good to have an electric type move just to cover, you know, water types. Although I can't remember if, no, Pikachu fainted, so. We currently don't have uh, an electric type user, I don't think. You know what? Let's do it. We'll do that and we'll do fire punch, maybe. Yeah, yeah, we'll do fire punch. We're gonna run out of, uh, I'm probably gonna run out of money, but I don't really mind. It's pretty easy to get in this game, honestly. Okay. Let's go to EV. Um, nothing quite yet. Um, I don't remember if I bought it for anyone else, but we're just going to do this anyways. Leafeon. Uh, energy ball. That's tempting. X scissors are tempting too. Let's do X scissor and energy ball. Okay, and I don't think we have enough to get anything for Baneri, but we will, oh, we might.
Ooh, an ice move. Oh, we're just short. Okay, well, why don't we save up for an ice move? Um, just so we, again, so we have that type coverage. Okay. Nope. We should probably do some, some grit training too. Um... Let's see. Let's go ahead and do this. This is from what? Up to level three. And we have quite a few of it, so. Oops. I just kind of accidentally clicked and I did it again. For some reason, I always want to like double click there. Um. Let's finish out our special defense. And let's do our speed. And get that up so we can get to the next level. We're gonna go also to um gonna do speed. Special attack. And we're going to do speed again. Speed's incredibly important in this game. So it doesn't hurt to, to add to um, speed stats when you can. Yeah, especially you, Leafeon. Um, okay, why don't we hold off for now? And then, okay. Alright, when we get to the Meyer lands, I'm gonna check the box and move all of our unimportant things away. Oh yeah, if you missed it, we also checked out, um, uh, we checked out a space-time distortion today as well, so, um, oh, hi, uh, Jake, <laughs> it's nice meeting you, <laughs> welcome to the stream, let's see, that girl who set out earlier must have been eating some of Benny's potato mochi. I could still smell it on her. That reminds me. I've seen Mistress Calaba riding around on that Ursa Luna she serves, uh, digging for treasure in the ground. I wonder if Ursa, Ursa Luna uses his sense of smell to suss out... <laughs> suss? <laughs> uh, suss out where treasure might be. You playing Among Us? Or <laughs> what's going on? Okay. Mm -hmm. I'm going the wrong way, I think. Oh wait, I said I was gonna go to the box, right? We've got way too many uh, unimportant things in our satchel right now. Oh, that's right, you can just move it all at once. Uh, please do let me know again if uh, I'm either too quiet or, um, or if the game audio is, you know, not great. Oh, you like that yourself, Leon? That's awesome. <laughs> I'm glad. <laughs> I'm glad you guys could make it too. Um, let's see. King sleep. We'll move that over. I am, I'm very new. <laughs> I'm new as of, uh, probably like a week ago. <laughs> so, yeah, hi. <laughs> um, let's do this here. 
Okay, I think we're, I think we're good. Okay, um, and in case you're wondering, I've got a, uh, I've got both my YouTube and Twitch up. So if I'm talking, you know, to someone, I'll try, I'll try to use names. So Jake, yes, I am new. Thank you. <laughs> Why do I feel like I'm lost? Where am I going? There, no, that's a new request. Oh, that's right, duh, I am lost because I need to use Ursa Luna. Um, there. Take me away, Ursa Luna. Is it this way? No. Or is it this way? There's stuff. I don't, I definitely, yeah, this isn't. Unless the Rizu is hiding underground. Which, no, it's an old verse. Specifically number nine. Um, yeah, I guess we could read it now. I set the bones of Pokemon adrift upon the river. Well, that's depressing. <laughs> I let my memories flow on, adrift upon the river. Into the ocean they will flow. Perhaps around the world they'll go. How many bones in days now gone have I now set adrift from me? How many bones in days to come will I yet seek adrift, or will I yet set adrift to sea? Sorry. <laughs> While every gift with which I part takes a silver, silver, a sliver of my heart. Again, I can't read very well. <laughs> Let's see. Uh, join the Pokemon Discord? Oh, cool. That's neat. Um, I'll help. I'll have to do that. Thanks, Jake. Oh, I didn't mean to to do a barrel roll. Okay. So is it the green one that I'm following, or is that just everywhere? I think that's just everywhere. Well, let's go this way. No. Oh. <laughs> well, uh, yeah, I, oh, there it is. There's a Rizu. It's the blue one. Um, yeah, no, I, uh, I have a very difficult time, uh, with reading out loud, so this is definitely a test of my, uh, my skills. <laughs> Or my lack thereof, I guess. Oh, hey, don't, yeah, you don't need to, you don't need to worry about me. I'm good. Yeah, you know, mm -mm. please leave me alone. Because I found them. Or her, I found her. Twix, where, where'd you go? I just hear a, a random from behind me. <laughs> uh, okay. Oh, Akari, how did it all go with her Saluna? Um, I calmed him down. Wow, you really are strong. But how'd you find me all the way out here? Um, Ursa Luna found you. Not me. He tracked me all the way here by the scent of those potato mochi I ate? That Ursaluna sure is something. I know he is descended from one of the Pokemon that uh, were blessed by Almighty Sinnoh, but still, wow. 